if you do like this rant right now, hit the like, comment, subscribe, and the bell notification, because holy fuck, man, like, this shit is, this shit's really dumb, but yeah, anyways. So I usually try and make videos, try, try to do once a day, but this is more of just like an off-the-cuff thing again. Uh, tomorrow we're going to be looking at the, um, the Boeing engineering thing, uh, and, uh, the shady nature of it on both sides, uh, regarding the suicide, but, uh, yeah, just figured to make this off-the-cuff video real quick. Do you know what I fucking hate? Scammers. Yep, absolutely. I believe I made a video on this earlier, it's, the link's gonna be in the description about overseas call centers, right? And if you're a, somebody, a scammer, a fucking scumbag, I, I, you, you are the closest thing to someone who I hate, right? I don't hate anybody, right? I have, but holy fuck, they, that is like one of the top things that like get, grind my fucking gears. So, okay. I was on Craigslist. I was getting a car, right? And the guy said so he's from DC Auto in Savannah, Georgia. Don't harass the fucking business if you see this video. I hope I make myself clear. Anyways. So, he said, because I found one of his cars on Craigslist for like 1100 bucks, right? I got him to wiggle it down to 600 which, you know, normally, you know, like, should I draw in red flags? It did, but I looked into the business, and everything seemed legit. They seemed to be updated with the state of Georgia, all these different things. So, but just to make sure I get a specific vehicle number, which is a VIN number, I don't know internationally what it's called, what it's called but in the best country in the world, aka the United States of America, we call it a VIN number, right? A vehicle identification number. So he gave me that. I look into the vehicle. Same color, same year, same make, same model, right? So I'm like, okay, here's a $600, right? The business was legit. The phone number came back. Has no red flags. The VIN matched the description of the car, year, make, model, and color. So I'm like, you know what? Fuck it, right? There's no way this guy's a scammer, right? Everything is legitimate according to everything I've seen, right? Wrong! Absolutely wrong, baby! You know what fucking happened? My ass got fucking scammed! But, and I hope, I hope to God, and, and I know your name is Bryant, by the way, I hope to God you raise a family, okay? I hope to God you raise some beautiful children, right? And then when you are at your worst point in life, I hope your wife ends up dating Ryan Reynolds, leaves you and the kids, takes half, takes all of your money, leaves you on the streets, and I hope you get a shotgun to your mouth. I hope you just put it to your mouth. And I hope you contemplate death for all of fucking eternity, okay? And I hope, I hope to God, you are not saved by Jesus yet. Because someone who does that shit, there's no way you are. There's no way you are. There's no way you're saved by God. So you're probably going to burn in hell. You're probably going to burn in Dante's last inferno. You're probably going to burn with Adolf Hitler and Saddam Hussein, okay? That's what I hope for you. I hope you contemplate death the rest of your life. Because when you do that shit, you, you don't deserve, you don't deserve to be, you don't deserve to get food in your mouth. And you may be like, well, well Ryan, that could be a horse. No, absolutely not. I swear to God, no. Okay? I have autism. Okay, I'm autistic. I've tried. I'm on fucking social security right now because I'm in between work because my car got in a fucking wreck. I was going to use this shit to get back on my fucking feet. Okay? That's what I was going to do. I was going to do this shit to get back on my feet. I literally just do this when I'm not doing Instacart or Uber Eats, etc., etc. Because I feel like it. It's it's something I like to do, right? It's sort of like a personal diary of sorts. Sort of just a hobby, right? Like, obviously you don't have the subscriber count to make money from this, but I, either way, I love fucking doing it, okay? It's fucking fun. I can upload my music, I can fucking talk about corruption, fucking ca call people fucking poopy head and butt face. It's, you know, it's fun, right? It's just a fun thing I like to do. And I've kind of turned into like a little personal diary. But anyways... Let's, let's, let's get into the... Let's get out of that. So, I was car at 3 p.m. yesterday, right? 
It's eight nine o'clock. I'm ca- I call this guy. He's like, oh, uh, he. Sh- uh, I'm gonna get an ETA for you, right? Do you know what he doesn't? T- he, you know what he t- and so doesn't give me an ETA all night. I'm up till one in the clock the fucking morning, sitting in my car, waiting for this man to fucking pull up. He doesn't. So I call all morning, call all night, all morning. Finally, he gets, he answers at 11 a.m. Tells me the driver was fucking drunk on whiskey and blew out a tire in his truck that was towing the car. So again, you admit to a crime, but I don't give enough of a fuck about that. I genuinely just want the fucking car. So I'm like, you know what? What's the ETA you'll give me? An hour and 40 minutes, okay? So I call this man from, like, literally 1.40. The time frame he gave me, it would have been here at 12.45. Give an extra hour, right? I've been calling this man since 1.40 in the fucking afternoon, okay? He has not answered a single call or a single text. Now, I start to think, you know what? This is probably a bit fucking shady, right? I know I'm not slim, but god damn it, the puns are good right now. We might as well keep shooting these motherfuckers off like shotgun shells. But anyways, that's beyond the point. So I call my local police department, and I report this to Cash Out, by the way, at one in the morning, because I thought, what if, the odds are, probably not, this is probably not going to happen, but what if it does, right? And either way, I can always call Cash Out and say, you know what, yeah, yeah they actually didn't have delivery in the car, right? That didn't fucking happen. So I go and call my local sheriff station, because... The city police, I'm in the unincorporated area, so I have to call the county sheriffs. The county sheriffs tell me, file a report with the FB fucking I, okay? Do you think... Do you think I want to spend a microsecond of my day interacting with the FBI? No. The answer is a big fat fucking no, okay? So I have to fill out this fucking massive fucking report... Okay. With the fucking FBI, the fucking federal federal bureau of investigations, because this fucking greased up fucking cuckold in fucking Savannah, Georgia, does not want to fucking deliver my car and is making every single butt fuck excuse possible. Basically going full goatsy in my fucking face and shitting in my fucking mouth. So I'm like, you know what? Fuck this shit, right? And now I'm fucking having to do the, do that. I'm having to call Cash App because I fucking sent them the money via Cash App and I have to send fucking Cash App this long ass FBI report. I've been having to work on this shit for like, an, I want to say like roughly an hour or two now. This is fucking ridiculous. I swear to God, okay? Shove a Moby Huge up my ass. It would be a lot less painful than having to deal with this fucking old cuckold, okay? This fucking, like, this fucking, like, A-Seaster looking head-ass boy. Fucking, like, this, fu- this, this fucking incest baby, okay? This fucking fifth generation fucking, like, fucking incest baby, okay? I swear to God, and honestly, the cum that was used to make him, if I could go back in time, I wouldn't even make the girl swallow, okay? I would have him burn... I would have the father burn the spe- the semen burnt for not so that way it can't even be remotely consumed okay so there's not even a chance at fucking reproduction okay I would have that shit just sh- sent off to the fucking sun if I could okay like because people like this are fucking garbage human beings man like I swear to god I can't tell the difference between this man and this bag of trash, okay? There's no fucking difference to me, okay? Like, at this point, we're like, holy fuck. And you're gonna probably get a lot of these videos, because my luck is fucking horrible when I don't need it. But for some reason, like, I can have shit go wrong with a car and I don't get fucking injured. Like, holy fuck, man. This is, this is fucking ridiculous, man. Like, th- this shit fucking pisses me off. Like, holy fuck. The, the, the levels people stoop so low to. It's fucking ridiculous, man. Like, 
Like, I, I, I swear to God. Like. Like, what, like, I don't, I don't know why the fuck I have such bad luck, but, you know, it is what it is. Uh, gotta keep pushing, gotta keep doing what I need to do, but anyways. Yeah, if you, if you like the video, like I said, comment, like, subscribe, all that shit. I mean, hit the bell notification, because, yeah, I really want to make something on YouTube, and, you know, I really do, this is something I really like doing. Whether it's, like I said, the music uh, in the channel, you know, science, NPC, music, politics, culture, pod, podcast, 101. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, it's pretty much, you know, it's pretty much it. Uh, yeah. I guess, uh, yeah. Peace.